Hey guys, I'm here. Welcome back to our OBGYN Stenography Ridge Review. Feel free to pause the video after I ask a question, give enough time to answer it before I answer it. Let's dive into this thing. This image most likely demonstrates what? A. Esophageal atresia. B. Duodenal atresia. C. Renal agenesis. Or D. Pulmonary hypoplasia. The answer is A. Esophageal atresia. Drag and drop the letter X on the vertebral body. The vertebral body is right here. Which best describes this probe? A. Phase array, B. Convex sequential, C. Matrix array, or deep linear array. The answer is C, matrix array. Click on the maternal contribution of the placenta. The answer is going to be right in this region here. This is the decidua basalis. Which is a contraindication for an oocyte retrieval procedure? A. Ovarian cancer, B. Marfan syndrome, C. Preeclampsia, or D. Repeated abortions. The answer is B. Marfan syndrome. Which best describes this probe? A. Matrix array, B. Convex array, C. Linear array, or D. Phased array? The answer is A. Matrix array. Which was used to demonstrate the bony structures in this video? A. Surface rendering, B. 4D volume rendering, C, maximum intensity projections, or D, minimum intensity projections. The answer is... C. Maximum Intensity Projections Which is associated with renal agenesis? A. Central Dot Sign B. Champagne Sign C. Adrenal Sign or D. Keyhole Sign The answer is C. Adrenal Sign Click on the fourth ventricle The answer is going to be right here. And this condition represents Dandy Walker malformation, which will not have a decreased PAP A. A. Turner syndrome, B. Patel syndrome, C. Edwards syndrome, or D. Down syndrome. The answer is B, Patel syndrome. 
What type of artifact will occur during endovaginal imaging of the uterus? A. Reverberation B. Acoustic shadowing C. Ring down or D. Mirror The answer is D. Mirror What does this image show? A. Vein of Galen aneurysm B. Encephalocil, C. Cephalocil, or D. Meningocil. The answer is Cephalocil, represented right here. How do you improve the color Doppler artifact indicated by the arrowhead? A. Decrease color gain. B. Increase PRF. C. Decrease wall filter, or D. Increase frequency. How do we improve this color doppler right here? The answer is B. Increase PRF to reduce or eliminate aliasing. You're evaluating a cytosolitis fetus in the supine cephalic presentation. Which structure below will be the most superficial on your image if you're in a transverse axial view of the abdomen? A. Stomach B. Descending aorta C. Spine or D. Portal sinus The answer is D. Portal sinus What is the arrow pointing to? A. IUD, B. Cerclage, C. Escher, or D. Fibroid. The answer is B. Cerclage. Which is not a complication of ovarian hyperstimulation syndrome? A. Acute respiratory distress syndrome. B. Renal failure, C. Thromboembolism, or D. Pericardial effusion. The answer is D. Pericardial effusion. Which type of artifact will a intrauterine device create? A. Reverberation, B. Acoustic enhancement, C. Comatel, or D. Acoustic shadowing. The answer is D, acoustic shadowing. During a transabdominal examination, which way do you angle the probe to visualize a retroverted uterus while in the transverse view? A, ventrally, B, anteriorly, C, caudally, or D, cephalic? The answer is C. Caudally. How do you improve this image? A. Decrease color gain. B. Increase wall filter. C. Decrease scale. Or D. Increase PRF. The answer is A. Decrease color gain. Which is the permanent form of birth control? A. IUD B. Hormone replacement therapy C. Escher device or D. Cerclage The answer is C. Escher device Which artifact is demonstrated here? A. Ring down B. Reverberation C. Comatel, or D. Acoustic shadowing. The answer is B. Reverberation. Which of the following will have the greatest impact on reducing attenuation artifacts when imaging a fetus? A. Surface rendering. B. 4D volume rendering. 
C, minimum intensity projections, or D, maximum intensity projections. The answer is A, surface rendering. What type of artifact will a dermoid plug create? A, reverberation, B, ring down, C, acoustic enhancement, or D, acoustic shadowing. The answer is D, acoustic shadowing. How do you improve this image? A, decrease scale, B, increase PRF, C, increase frequency, or D, decrease color gain. The answer is B, increase PRF to eliminate the spectral Doppler aliasing. What is the situs and presentation of this fetus? A, cephalic and cytosolitis, B, breach and situs ambiguous, C, breach and cytosolitis, or D, cephalic and situs inversus. The answer is A, cephalic and cytosolitis. During a transvaginal examination, which way do you angle the probe to visualize the fundus in a retroverted uterus while in the transverse view? A, anteriorly, B, caudal, C, dorsal, or D, cephalic? The answer is C, dorsal. If any of you have any questions about your upcoming OBGYN boards, feel free to reach out to me at ultrasoundboardview at gmail.com or you can personally text or call at 435-922-1635. I'm Jim with ultrasoundboardview.com. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time.